Hello and welcome to this tutorial of Shopify Odoo Connector by Ami Pro. In this video, I will show you how to import and update products, product image, description, price and stock. Also, I will show you that how to import and update collections from Shopify to Odoo. For that, go to Shopify. And before start importing, let me show you that in my this instance, I have zero products, zero smart collection and custom collection. And let me show you in the sales also under the catalog we have products and here I do not have any products right now and I want to import products and collections from Shopify so I will show you that all are available in our store so go to our store and then in the product we have this all the products available here and let's go to collection here we have three collection available sales men and women so again go to product and let me open one product so let me open hair dryer and here we can see that the description of our product is available here black hair dryer and here we have the price of this product and let's scroll down and we can see that we have inventory policy and the quantity of this product is 20 so this quantity will go to our stock category and we can see the image of our product which we will fetch in our Odoo so this is all the products and the collection we will import in our Shopify for that perform operation and here in the Shopify to ERP we will perform this all the operations. Let's say we want to import our products so go to products and sync product and then we want to import our collections so go to collection and click on here and when we will import our products it will fetch the images and price with that product because we have configured that option in our connector settings. So let me show you that. In our Shopify settings, we have this option of product bulk sync operation. So we have already configured that sync images and import or sync price import with our product. I want to import the images and the price with my product. So I will keep this option check. So let's go to our Shopify. And if I want to import the stock of my product, I have to check here and then execute. And here we can see that 10 products, one custom collection and two smart collection imported successfully. And now let's go to inside of this product. So click on this, open one product. Here we can see in the description we have black hair dryer which was showing us on our Shopify front store also. And then let's go to gallery image. And here we fetch the image also. And now for the price and the stock we will go to our sales go to products and here we can see that our, all the products product price and product images are available on this product section but here we cannot see that any of the stock of this all the products for importing the stock our connector will have one more process so let me show you that go to shopify and scroll down go to instances open your instance but before doing this all the process done let me explain you that why this all the steps are required for importing our product stock when you will handling multiple instances for your multiple stores every shopify store will have individual inventory for that particular store so at that time you will need to set inventory or stock from your particular selected instance for that purpose we are doing this all the process for importing our product stock in our instance so let's go to last inventory and select the inventory for instance and then here we have to select this option start inventory and then it will ask me that validate that inventory so let me click on this so now let's see that what is the status in our product section in our sales area so go to product and yes here we got the product stock in our all the products here we can see that and now I need to inform you something about the price list of our instance because we have just one instance available in our Odoo we are getting imported price in our product and it shows me here but if I would have multiple instances in my Odoo and if I will import products and product price from Shopify to Odoo I have to check that price imported in the price list which is here let's open it 
here we can configure multiple price list for individual Shopify stores and also we can set only one price list for all the stores and here I have just one price list public price list so open it and scroll down and here we can see that all the price is visible and this price list which we have imported in our Odoo so till now we have imported our products now we will update our product in the Shopify and that updated product we will again import in our Odoo so let's go to our Shopify and then here we have some products let's open one product let's say jeans and I will update the product let's say here in the description I will change the description so I will edit it jeans for man and then I will add the image from here now scroll down and I will change the price also so let's say 150 and then here I will change the quantity of this jeans let's say I will do it 300 and then I will save this so here I have updated the description and the product image and product price and quantity and there's all the changes we will import in our Odoo for that go to Shopify perform operation Shopify to ERP select here on the sync product and import stock and then execute so finally our updated changes are imported successfully so let's check in the products open the jeans go to gallery image and here we got the another image of this product and to see the change of price and stock we will go to our sales and then go to price list open it and here in the jeans we can see that updated price is 150 is here and for the update of our stock we will do that process again go to Shopify and then instance open it here in the inventory for instance and then start inventory scroll down and here we can see in the jeans we have theoretical quantity 200 and the real quantity we have updated and our Shopify which is 300 so here it is showing me so now I will validate this inventory to see the changes go to sales open the product and here in the jeans we can see that on hand we have 300 quantities and for the price changes we will every time see in the price list and now let's check that what is the status of our collection for that go to Shopify and then open the custom collection here is the man option again go to dashboard and then open the smart collection here we have cell and women collection and this collection we can open it by clicking here and here we can see that all the configurations are here so again go to Shopify dashboard and now we will again go to our Shopify store and then we will update our collection and then we will again import it in our Odoo so let's open one collection let's say sale and then we will change this description of this collection so here is the this is the great sale of this year we will change it by grand sale and then we will change the image select your image and then save this collection now let's import and update this in our Odoo so now let's go to our Odoo and Shopify connector perform operation and then click on the import collection and then execute so now let's see that what are the changes are updated in our collection so we have updated in our sale collection so go to smart collection and here we have the sale collection open it and yes we can see that the changes are updated in our Odoo so here this image is changed and the description of this collection is also changed so this is how we can import and update our products product price image stock and description also we can import and update the collections thank you for watching this video i hope the video was helpful amipro specializes in providing customization consultancy and support for any and all services related to odoo so feel free to contact us on www.amiprotechnologies.com.